was thinking to set up an exercise area for Omeo, we could use this side of the room. It's where the heat comes in, so it'd be nice and toasty. This gate has been used for so many different animals. It's amazing. Mr. Omeo has been really getting good with his climbing. He's really improving on those skills, and I think this will maybe give him a challenge. Omeo's been living in this incubator space for good reason. He wasn't thermoregulating when we initially received him for his care. But now, since he's developed a thick coat of fur, his muscle development is significant. He wants to be on top of his stuffy. And if he had his mom, he would be riding on her shoulders and sometimes even on her head. He's really getting some great hand-eye coordination, or he developing is, yeah, some great. Yeah, he is really turning into a little koala. Hey there, bud. What do you think? You want to come out and check out your new digs? We've made you an Omeo habitat, and I think you will like it. I hope you will like it. We want to make sure that we're matching the milestones that they would be matching and be doing in nature. All right, I'm going to hand them to you, and you can hook them up. Let me get a couple of clothespins. Hi, buddy. Pouch emergence is a huge milestone. They're going to spend a lot of time on mom's front, a lot of time on her back, and then they'll stick their head into the pouch to nurse. I'll clip it and let me know if he's resting on the ground or if he's hanging. That hanging is a nice simulation of how he would be in mom's pouch. So having it off the ground just a tad, I think that's going to be a perfect height okay. for this. We can give him. Um, say like an hour of supervised time in here so we make sure he doesn't get himself into any trouble. And then as time goes on, we can increase the space if we want to and then just use the incubator for overnight. Every once in a while, he still gets a little head tremor. I think it was just when he gets really excited. Mm -hmm. So that there, I'm gonna get him a piece of eucalyptus. This area that we've built for him today allows him to move out of a closed area that was important in the, in, in the initial stages of his development to keep him warm. What a good boy. But it's now important to allow him to develop his muscles, climb, allow him to locomote vertically and horizontally, and do what he wants to do. It's a big effort. <laughs> Let me help you out. There, there you we go. go. <laughs> you grab it. There you go. Yeah. Make sure we don't tucker him out too much mm -hmm. and throw off his schedule. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Baby steps for the baby. Tia's is so funny. <laughs> you getting tuckered out? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so close. I think he's tuckered. I do, put too. Put him back in. I think New he space. approves. I think he approves. Yeah. <laughs> well, then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, little man. All right, back you to You want to go back in? As he's developing confidence, we'll back off a little bit and allow him to have an hour on his own. Yeah. There we go, bud. All right, little dude. Eventually, he'll be spending his entire day in the play area until he's able to meet his koala family. Right, What'd you think? Was that really super fun? <laughs> it looked like he nodded. I know. He's like, <laughs> yeah, I kind of liked it. is going to receive a routine health check. Oh my gosh, look at how big he is. He's huge. <gasps> oh, he's curly. I know, all the little cowlicks. <laughs> look at you. Hi, Hi, doctor. I last saw Omeo about two weeks ago. <laughs> and last I saw him, he had just started to get fur covering his chest and his back. You look like a koala. <laughs> Imagine that. So today we're going to check on um, his vitality, his body weight. I'll listen to his lungs, and check his joints and his strengths, but he looks like he's really, really strong. Is it okay if I look in your eyes? Mm -hmm. I know, yeah. I know. Come on, it's all right. Relax. There you go. Good boy. I know. <coughs> what is that? He's trying to grab the light. His eyes look nice and clear. I smell first. All right, we're gonna listen now. Heart sounds really good. No heart murmur. He sounds great. I don't hear any crackles or wheezes, no pops. Okay. So 
Nice little belly massage. Everything's looking great with Omeo. All of his bones, his joints, his belly, his, everything feels normal, and uh, his lungs sound really good. Check his lymph nodes. It was touch and go for, for quite a long time for him. Um, he needed a lot of specialty care all through the night. And we weren't sure that he was going to make it. So to see him thriving now is pretty amazing. Oh, yeah, I can't believe how. Yeah, it's... I, I can't believe he looks like a little koala now. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think with his great weight gain and his really good vitality and all of his development and his luxurious new coat, um, I think it would be OK if he starts going on a walkabout in the area with the adult koalas. Yay. Hey, Jen, come on so in. How did things go today? Does he look good? Fantastic. I'm going to step out, give you guys some room, but okay. I want to hang out because I would love to see this. Okay. And then I look for his face. <laughs> All right, buddy. How about we check out the mail walkway? So, what do you think? Yeah? It's going to be your new home someday, maybe in a few months. All these new sounds, you're not used to that, I know. You're getting so big. This is the first time I've worn him with the wrap, and he seems extra curious. He's got his head out, um, really taking it all in. He's getting an opportunity to smell the different boys in the area, but also the different sounds in the area. So um, he's going to do great out here. He's very content. Yes, yeah, like this is natural. Yeah. This, is, this is the way it's supposed to be for him. This is amazing to see him having come this far and to see him outside looking like a koala and having koala instincts. He's uh, not out of the woods yet. He's um, still a little small, but each step we've made for him, um, we've, oh gosh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> From that night when I didn't think he was gonna make it. To see this. He's a fighter. Yeah, he sure is. That. He sure is. It's like he, he needs his new challenge even before he's had his last challenge. Uh, I'm so pleased. Yeah. He may be small, but you're tough. And he's falling asleep. It's tough being a little it's, Joey. <laughs> it's tough having everybody love you. <laughs> <laughs>